Well, guys, it was too good to be true. <laughs> it was, and it was only a matter of time. Like, honestly, let's be real here. And it's sad to say, and I don't even know how I'm laughing right now or why I'm laughing right now. I mean, I guess at this point it is all a joke. But it was only a matter of time for, for this to happen. My Tokyo Ghoul Re Episode 5 reaction taken down by Marvelous. And you guys have probably watched so many other videos from other YouTubers you know, with this same kind of issue going on with, with copyright strikes, especially from Marvelous. Which, if you look at the email right there, I see Molebeat. And I'm just like, okay, Molebeat? Is this like the same company or what? Because Molebeat, if you guys don't remember or don't know, in the past was notorious for taking down so many videos. And... That's kind of how Marvelous has been lately. So I guess that would explain it if they're somehow affiliated or the same company or, or what. I don't really know how it all works. I haven't even done any research on Marvelous. I did for Molebeat like in the past. I honestly don't even really care. The thing that I still don't get, man, is that it's a music. It's a music company. There's no audio. There's no music in my videos for Tokyo Ghoul Re. And... For a lot of other people's Tokyo Ghoul Re videos as well, there's no audio, there's no music. So how is this even allowed to happen? How is this able to happen? Uh, it's the same old song and dance, man. Like, I, I have no answers, and this is just how it is. Like, this is how it's always been. <laughs> so, I mean, there's there's nothing really I, I can say that I haven't said in the past. So, really, all this video is, to inform you guys, I got a strike on the channel now, which means there's going to be no more streams, and there's going to be no more Tokyo Ghoul Re videos, because I'm not taking any chances. Like, why would I even further uh, risk the channel more by putting out more Tokyo Ghoul Re content? Uh, not going to happen. So, sorry if you guys you know, were enjoying the, the Tokyo Ghoul content. I just can't put the channel at any further risk. I've already went ahead and deleted the Tokyo Ghoul Re videos that I had. And a lot of other people are going through the, the same issues right now and the same problems. I know one of my really good friends of the community, Sun Wukong, is going through it. You guys that follow my channel probably follow his a, as well. And that that video that he put out, and he's been forced to move to his second channel, uh, DJ Nikki. So, I mean, am I going to another channel? No, I only have one strike on my channel. So I, I can kind of still do what I've been doing right now, just besides the streaming aspect of, of it, obviously. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, submit a counter notification, and you know, hopefully that'll be off in two or three weeks. You know, YouTube's a really, really fast system, right? <laughs> so besides that, obviously videos are going to be uh, pre-recorded. Uh, things aren't changing, right? I'm still going to have the shows that I'm covering besides Tokyo Ghoul Re. And, yeah, that's really all this video was to inform you guys of, is what's going on with Tokyo Ghoul Re, no more Tokyo Ghoul Re, and uh, things will be continuing on as normal from here, minus Tokyo Ghoul Re and streaming. So if you guys have any questions or anything you want to say, uh, drop a comment down below, and thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.